Good day, fellas. I hope you are ready for your daily dose of skill. And as you can see, today we have a guest. Today we have Katito on stream and, uh, well, I suppose to say on YouTube video. And she is having a blast while cuddling and while enjoying Tornwagen. As you can see, she is even feeling dirty while looking at this tank. Now, jokes aside, boys and girls, ladies and gentlemen, this vehicle is one of the most disgusting and best tanks, believe me or not. The best thing about the Tornwagen is that you can play hold down ideally. The worst thing about the Tornwagen is it's it's useless unless you are playing hold down if that makes sense. It is it is very very weird combination. I really like the gentleman who uh, was the other day in the stream and he said skill. Everyone was saying Tornwagen is pile of caco. And I did not understood this. I was looking armor model. It is looking fine. I was looking the gun handling soft stats. It looks fine. But truth to be told, I cannot play with this tank. It's disgusting. You know, and this is how I feel like you just simply cannot judge um, about the tank from the stats. You simply cannot judge uh, a tank this way anymore in the world of tanks. Or maybe anymore is a wrong word. Uh, you cannot judge the tank by the stats from the from very, very, very long time, okay? That's what I want to say and this is how I feel like. Now, speaking about the gameplay of the Tornwagen. All and all, I would say Tornwagen would be fine tank if the DPM would be a tiny touch better. Now the bigger, the biggest problem at least in... There you go. You see? You see? That's what I'm talking about. Even Katita was discussed. discussed. The biggest problem uh, of this vehicle is simply DPM, right? That's what I want to believe. If the DPM would be tiny touch better... It would feel definitely better as a vehicle itself. And in the same time, DPM is one part of all this. Keep this in mind, there is, uh, there is mobility issue as well. Whenever you are arriving to the hold down position, yes, you are feeling quite confident and you are feeling quite all right. But if you cannot reach position, in other words, if someone else can get there faster than you can, it is a problem. And I do not want to uh, shit talk the tanks, you know? It is not my mission and this is not what I want to do, but I really want to be honest with you that this vehicle is far away from being ideal and far away from being uh, the top tier tank, okay? That's what I want to highlight. It's just simply... Not the tank I would trust or I personally would enjoy playing. Obviously, you can try to fix this tank by adding turbo, but then you will ruin your gun handling even more. And the gun handling is far away from being ideal of, of this tank, at least in my humble opinion. And if you would pay attention at the index page, uh, the index page is showing that gun handling is bad and the speed is bad of this vehicle and whatnot. And overall, the tank is far away from being ideal, to be fair with you. So, yeah. Anyways, we arrived to position, fellas. Three minutes in, we are in the position and we can start playing our game. Can you imagine that? That's all we needed, fellas. Three minutes and we are ready to go. Meanwhile, what we know, we know Gusor is sitting here in the back. That's what we know. How about this? Unfortunate. That's okay. No, Mr. Love. How are you doing this fine day? I mean, this Love is playing well. You, you cannot say he's playing badly by any shape or any form. Don't you think so? I'm trying to find the pixel and here you go. Pixel it is. Beautiful, beautiful, beautiful. Mm. I'm loading high explosive. Actually, I do not even have high explosive ammunition. That's quite a stinker. This is very hard to outplay this guy, fellas. Uh, Love has a decent amount of the armor, as you can see yourself. So, it's quite complicated uh, situation for us to deal with him. But we will try to do our best. We are okay. Meanwhile, Swiper. Swiper is sitting here, hold down. He's feeling very, very, very well. 
Meanwhile, we know they have a sniper schnitzel somewhere over there and once again, I just simply cannot make pressure. I do not think I can afford to go through the open field in order to um, mess them up. So at this point, you just simply need to go for a blind shots. Yeah, definitely, definitely not the best vehicle in the world of tanks, but you know what? Let's give this tank a fair go. Let's not YOLO in like crazy mother truckers, but let's try to play this tank strengths. To play hold down as much as we physically and possibly can and so on, so on. Hmm. Step by step, fellas. I want to find this gentleman who is sitting here next to the red line. Because there is nothing what I can do. The thing is, uh, potentially we could try to relocate if we would have speed. We could go and push the other side. But you know, the game would be over if I would start going back and after that attacking the other side. The game will be over, fellas. I just simply cannot afford this. You know, we do not have enough... Uh, uh, enough time for this. We simply don't. So, the best play for us in this kind of situation is just to keep blind shooting the same area. I just cannot see the opportunity to do something else. No, maybe like so. It's okay. Swiper is down to uh, two shotable. That is completely fine. Huh. One more blind shot, because why not? Beautiful. We spanked the living crap out of that poor soul. And we did everything properly, in my humble opinion. That was a good one. Meanwhile. This is where this tank is strong yet. Playing hold down to the best of our abilities, right? This is where this tank is strong yet. Good. Very, very good. How about shot like so? Close but no banana. It's okay. We have all time, fellas. We have all time over there. Swiper is making a bit of pressure. Oh, that was a bad shot. Oh, that was a very, very, very bad shot, boys and girls, ladies and gentlemen. That was no bueno. Okay, he's just going for us. I need to try to retreat. I must try to retreat, fellas. I know Trash 103 will definitely reload quicker than I do. That's okay. Can we eliminate him from the game? Yes, we can. Now, he's face-hugging us. I do not really mind that much, believe me or not. Face-hugging is not that bad for this vehicle, right? And at this point, let's try to punish him like so. Beautiful. I'm trying to stick my gun to the enemy gun, right? That's what I am trying to do. Unfortunately, I do not have enough horses. And I am going to shoot Progetto. Nah, Progetto will shoot me. It's okay. Listen. This is the best play which I physically and possibly could have done with a torn wagon. This is, this is like a book play to a certain extent. We went to, to play here. We did not met anyone um, making silly goose mistakes. We made pressure in front. We blind shoot the living crap out of the enemy here. And that's okay. This should be 4,000 damage. But you see what I'm saying, fellas? It is, in my humble opinion, it is extremely, extremely boring tank to play with. It is very boring. And in the same time, it is quite a big pain in the ass to deal, uh, for enemies to deal with us, you know? This is how I feel like. It's not really interesting tank to play, and it is pain in the ass tank to deal with. So, maybe it's only me. Anyways, let's see the score, shall we? Unfortunately, fellas, we are coming back with a defeat. I was looking... Uh, I was looking at the score, 10 to 10, 11 to 10, uh, 12 to 10, 12 to 12. Unfortunately, defeat it is. But you know what? I am feeling very, very, very happy with my result, what I, what I crafted in this game. And look at this beauty. 3.5 thousand damage, right? 
400 assisting damage. This is not a good, this is not a bad score with a torn wagon. Luckily for enemies they had Progetto who noticed he can spank me like there is no tomorrow. But other than that, uh, we are booming and we were feeling pretty well. Obviously a lot of shots fired, a lot of blind shots and luckily we connected quite some of them. Anyways, in the end of the day, 65,000 profits. Uh, Overall, a bit of the boring gameplay for me, speaking about the Torn Wagon as a performance, right? It, in other words, it's definitely not my favorite tank, right? Anyways, let's not allow bad feelings to hit us and let's continue our journey. Let's go. Okay, fellas, at this point, I am just feeling lucky. Look what kind of matchmaking we are having. Empire's bond, uh, border standard battle. So this is what you want to see with a Torn Wagon. The maps where you can play a down. And it doesn't really matter you are using your gun depression or not. And truth to be told, this play is one of the best um, holdown plays out there. Although, I must admit, I need to have some support not to be overrunned by the enemy forces. Because pretty much every tank in the world of tanks will have better DPM than Turdwagen, right? We need to keep this in mind. Um, so, that's just important thing to highlight. Overall, we are doing our best, fellas. Overall, we are doing our best. So... Juliet 2 it is. It will take quite some time until we will arrive there also in the same time once again. You could use potentially turbo for this tank but I really like ventilation and I really like improved aiming unit and rammer is also important because without rammer this DPM would be like what 13 and a half seconds or something crazy like this which is just simply no bueno at least in my book. Anyways I hope we are going to have someone who will go together with us. And if we will have someone, mwah, we are booming and we are enjoying ourselves. Let's hope for the best. No. Mr. Spitz, are you out of your mind? It's okay. Or is it? Yeah, it's okay. For now, I am feeling very, very good double penetrator and as you can see we can play hold down here but look how many forces do we have in front of ourselves and this is this is a bit of the problem right i cannot allow them to feel great here i just simply cannot allow them to feel great i need to do everything to the best of my abilities in order to just simply spank them like there is no tomorrow right if i can say so that's what I am trying to do. This guy is dead. Unfortunately, that was a low roll, but it doesn't really matter. It's okay. Meanwhile, pay attention to what is happening. They are actually pushing in front. I know I have some support in the back. I am very, very well aware of that, but this is this is an, a bit no bueno fate for us, if you know what I mean. Luckily, he missed, but Škoda never misses. I am getting armor rack twice. Yeah. Okay. I don't mind. I don't mind, fellas. Believe me or not, this is as good as we are going to get. Enemies had five guns over there. Five. Five guns. We had two guns. So we can't complain about this. Um, and this is the score. I'm telling you, this tank cannot defend himself, especially whenever you are playing two versus one or something. This is as good as it is going to get, fellas. Uh, so, Tornwagen on paper might look amazing tank. In reality, it's far away from being so. Anyways, let's teleport to the scoreboard. Ooh, this tank. Okay, fellas, um, as you can see, the things are not going that well, but this is the truth. If I would take from the... Uh, from the vote replays, you know, best games with a torn wagon, it would be a bit of a mispresentation of the tank. So I would rather be honest and not to have the best games, right? So we have 1.6 thousand damage, 900 assisting damage. This is as much as we are going to get because we simply got overrun it. We are in the mid by, exp by experience. We are fourth by the damage and we made... Um, 56,000 profits without including the rewards for completing missions. So far, after two games, our average performance is 2.5 thousand damage and 700 assisting damage. Can we make it better? Let's try to do our best. Last but not least, fellas, listen. 
Redshire Assault. Yes, we have the worst um, map possible for winning chances, but I think for this tank uh, it can work very, very well. I have a feeling that this is going to be a good one. All I need to do, I need to reach this position to stay hold down in front of us, to go over there. From there, we will be able to spank this cover 4 like there is no tomorrow. We just do not care, you know? But until then, I need to reach this, reach this position. This is very, very important. Charioteer, not a problem. Cover 4, not a problem. There is no one who could spank us apart Arthas, right? Arthas are pretty much the biggest um, game breaker for us. Uh, because believe me or not, even though this vehicle has a lot of armor, Arthas are chewing this tank like it would be a bloody chupa chups, you know? Or chewets, I suppose to say. Um, you know, it's just, it just how it feels like. But, once again. Enough of blah 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 blah. Oh boy, Arta is already shooting. Enough of blah blah blah, let's try to make it work. So, Mr. Nah. Minus 370. By the way, with this reload time, this alpha damage feels definitely lackluster for sure. I really want to highlight this. It definitely, it definitely doesn't feel great. Meanwhile, we are going in. We are not going to stop here for a moment. I do not need to stop. I need to push in front as much as I physically and possibly can. And now we are going to have a good time. Mr. Charioteer and Mr. Ergashem. I don't really care about... Okay. I was about to say I don't really care about Charioteer, but since Ergashem is dead, we are going to claim his hit points as well. Thank you very much, sir. Enjoy yourself. Good. We have quite a bit of the Arta support. Very, very nice. And at this point, we are crafting a decent angle for enemy mm, uh, Borat. Hmm. Oy, oy, we are winning this game. We are winning from the losing spawn. Oh, how unfortunate it is for a score. Usually, speaking about this uh, this map, it is very hard to attack. But it happened to be that enemies have no team. And sometimes it happens. Once in a while, you know, you are winning even from the losing spawns as well. Oy, 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 oy. What a session it is, fellas. What a session. I'm still not giving up. I know the game is 3 minutes already and it's um, actually okay. 2 minutes 50 seconds and the score is 8 to 1. <laughs> no, guys. Why would you do this to me? Why? Why? What have I done wrong? What have I done wrong? <laughs> Please. Let me play the game. I beg you. I'm not asking that much, do I? I am not asking that much. No. Can we hit him? Yes. 1.5 thousand damage. Fellas, I'm afraid we are about to break the world of tanks. So much damage with this vehicle never ever been done before. Oh my. 1.9 thousand damage. Can we spank Pirosami? Aka 666 devil over there. Oi, 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 oi. Yeah, 15 to 1. I mean, what do you want me to do? You see... Okay, now let's put our thoughts together and let's say everything straight. This vehicle, uh, let's start from the positive. This vehicle is capable of holding line hold down if enemies are not making pressure on you. The armor of this tank is actually okay. Uh, when we are done with the positive things... Uh, you cannot defend yourself because you do not have DPM, even though you have armor, the DPM is not the greatest, right? And it's just how it goes. After that, uh, mobility of this tank is very, very poor. Gun handling is not ideal either, right? So, uh, yeah, there is a lot of, a lot of bad things about this tank. Anyways, 1.9 thousand damage, 500 assisting damage, I'm okay, and 62,000 profits as well. I am accepting this, fellas. Three games, we won two games, um, we lost one game, unfortunate. We have 2.3 thousand damage and 600 assisting damage. It is a bit below average than I played with this tank. I, On average, I play for 2.5 thousand. So... Not that much. Half shot below average. 
Oi, 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 what a time this is. Anyways, I hope I made your day, fellas, just a bit better. I hope you are going to keep wallet tight to your tight in your pocket and you are not going to think about this vehicle because I can promise you that the tank is definitely uh, not the finest one, okay? So, weak session, but tomorrow we will, uh, we will have a better one. I believe so. Anyways, thank you very much for watching and see you very, very soon. Skill is out for today. Peace. Oh, what a shit tank that was. Whew.